Hello, my name is Molly Sterniolo and I am the Penn State Extension Master Gardener Coordinator for Center County, Pennsylvania. Welcome to the Belfont Children's Garden. This garden has been a Master Gardener project for almost 10 years. The Belfont Community Children's Garden is located 10 miles from the Pennsylvania State University in the historic town of Belfont, Pennsylvania. Hi, my name is Cynthia Dosso Van Druff, and I'm one of the project co-chairs for the Belfont Community Children's Garden. Family Discovery Days are public events and held four times a year to celebrate the change of the season. Each seasonal garden event is theme-based and all activities are hands-on. The children in attendance visit different stations to learn, hunt, explore and create. Each child makes something to take home and something to leave in the garden when they visit the next time. Now I'd like to introduce Sharon Miller and she will talk to you about how we transitioned from face-to-face -face family discovery days to virtual discovery days. Thank you. Hi there, my name is Sharon Miller. I'm the co-chair of the Belfont Community Children's Garden. When face-to-face -face learning was no longer possible, the Valfon Community Children's Garden volunteers devised a plan to include a virtual platform and still be interactive for the community. The platform of choice was Facebook. In order to make the projects engaging for the students and the children, we had hands-on activity kits that were created and put together with supplies necessary to do the crafts these kits were accompanied by videos which were posted on Facebook so the students could then get more information and other educational information on a particular activity or theme. For example, we did a section on birds and we had the students make pine cone Christmas ornaments. They were provided with all the supplies in the kit. A video was created on Facebook and they then were encouraged to actually put one of the pine cones on a Christmas tree that was located in the garden. This was our way of engaging the library, having the students go into the actual garden and have a hands-on activity, and also be able to interact with nature. This was our way of continuing to engage with our children in the community. We introduced this virtual uh, platform last spring. We will continue it through the winter and hopefully return face to face in spring of 2022. As a Main Street manager of downtown Belfont and a mother to two children, um, we love the Children's Garden. It is just an amazing resource that we have here in Belfont. My kids have learned so much about gardening, night pollinators, and have managed to grow sunflowers, much like these behind me that are over 10 feet tall that many of the neighbors stop by and take photos of in the neighborhood. <laughs> 